Houghton County Sheriff Brian McLean died Monday following an accident at his home. He will be laid to rest tomorrow. Our own Thomas Fournier put together a tribute to a long-standing public servant. He dedicated his life to the people of Houghton County. Sheriff Brian McLean was the longest tenured active sheriff in the state of Michigan, first elected in 1996. He's remembered for his warm heart, big smile, and larger-than-life personality. Commissioner Gretchen Jansen says that McLean and her sister were classmates. My family in particular has known um, his family since we first moved here in 1968. And my mom was telling me last night she remembered when he knocked on our door when he was 10 years old to do a project with my sister. I remember him in high school, you know, and then seeing him around later, you know, as his career was moving along. And, you know, he just was a nice person. He always um, helped out. You know, he was... Always smiling. Like I said, he lit up every room he walked into. Brian Cadwell, who is now the chief of police for Michigan Tech University, worked with McLean for well over 30 years. The time they spent together in the patrol car will never be forgotten. Uh, this week I've been going back and remembering all the times we had together. We, uh, we always enjoyed, uh, we enjoyed jokes for one thing. So if we uh, came across a situation which was uh, sad or tense, you know, police officers tend to laugh it off with a dark sense of humor and uh, there was never a dull moment in the patrol car when we were working together. Brian was one of those guys who was uh, a friend always, a good partner, a great colleague. We and having a, a good working relationship has been fantastic. We always had each other's backs and it's it's gonna be hard to go on without him. One thing I think we need to remember is that uh, you always think there's gonna be tomorrow but live live your life fully today and Brian did that he lived every day to the fullest. Roy Britz and Brian McLean were both born on the same day a connection that runs deep as they serve their community together. Britz was the undersheriff for McLean before moving on to Michigan Tech's police force. Well I guess what I would say about that is uh, the community was lucky to have him as a sheriff. Uh, 26 years he truly respected you as the public and understood death and showed that by attending as many funerals as he could. He understood that and the loss for people and the hardships people have. Yeah, Brian, Brian was a family man. He cared for his wife and his children very much. He um, did the best as, as any, any spouse or husband could do. He'll be missed by many, by many. Brian McLean is survived by his wife, Kelly, and their two children, Samuel and Caitlin McLean. Brian will be missed by the community he gave so much to. Thank you, Thomas, for that tribute. 